Hi, it's Olivia from Just In Mind. Today, we're going to walk you through making an interactive app prototype. Follow these steps to learn how to prototype your interactive app. To get started, we need two elements, a dynamic panel with multiple panels, each containing different content, of course, and a group of ellipses. Make sure that the number of ellipses matches the number of internal dynamic panels. Place these elements on the canvas and let's get started. With panel one of the dynamic panel selected, go to the events tab. Once there, select the on swipe left and set active panel options. Then select panel two and add a slide left transition effect. This will create the swipe left movement. Add another action after this one in the events tab. This will be an on swipe left and change style action. Select the second ellipse and change the background color to yellow. Add another on swipe left and change style action after the previous one. This time, we're going to select the furthest left ellipse and we're going to change the background color to gray. These two actions will change the state of the ellipse in the corresponding panel. Remember to change the links between the actions to with previous. Copy this event series and paste it to the other panels and be sure to change the respective panels and ellipses in the events. Remember to modify the panel you want to appear upon swiping left in each case. Change the corresponding ellipse to yellow. And make the others gray. See, now your prototype will change the panel and the ellipse every time you swipe left. We're now going to build the event that makes the prototype move right when you swipe right. Selecting panel two, click on the events tab. Select the on swipe right and set active panel options. Now we're going to select the previous panel, in our example, panel one, and add a slide right transition effect. Add an action on swipe right and change style action. Select the ellipse that corresponds to the previous panel, the one furthest on the left in our example, and change the background color to yellow. Add another on swipe right and change style action after the previous one. Select the ellipse that corresponds to the current panel, ellipse two in our case, and change the background color to gray. As before, change the links between the actions to with previous. Copy and paste this action to every panel you've created, changing the panels and ellipses as before. Click simulate and you'll see that when you swipe from one side to the other, the panel and its corresponding ellipse changes. Pretty easy, right?